Hello, I'm Mike from musicradiocreative.com. In this video, I'll show you how to do some awesome sound design with the plugins from Air Music Technology. Air Music Technology are a big part of the Summer of Sound and you can win all of their plugins in the AIEP3 complete package worth $999 by entering our awesome audio gear giveaway. Just head to mrc.fm slash giveaway. That is mrc.fm slash giveaway. As you can see, Air Music Technology build virtual instruments, high quality that can help you design sound and also create effects. So I thought we would head over into Logic Pro and have a play with some of their wonderful virtual instruments. So here they are under Audio Units Instruments Air Music Technology. I'm going to go through in order and review Hybrid, Loom, The Riser and Expand. And my favourite of which, which we'll get to later, is The Riser. You'll find out why soon. Let's play with Hybrid and have a look at how exactly this works. So firing up Logic the first time. Uh, I wish I could do this in Adobe Audition, but they don't accept virtual instruments at the, the current moment I'm making this video. Uh, so Hybrid, uh, it's basically a really cool synthesizer. Starts off with a typical kind of sine wave, you know, nothing too crazy. You can change, obviously, the um, the, the look to, to be different, a uh, different style of wave, if you like, all that kind of stuff, and kind of change these shapes and, and bring it in. Um, but obviously, they, they have a lot of different presets in here. They've got stuff for creating trance music. You know, the typical kind of trance chords and things like that. Soft basses as well. Let's let's head into a soft bass and have a listen to... Oh yeah, that is... That's nice and soft and easy. So there you go. Lots and lots of really cool stuff. Virtual instruments with a kick, I would say. You want to stick some bells in? They've got... And you can do that kind of cool glide. So that's all cool. Um, but then if you want to get into a bit of sound design inside hybrid, you want to be looking at the effects and they got cool stuff from Chaos Theory. Yeah, rather scary right the way through to Mirror Bells, which I quite like because you can kind of <laughs> create something that might fit well in a horror movie, I think. Uh, Nuke Wheeler. Nice, and I'm just hitting random keys, by the way. On my beautiful... <laughs> there it is, Akai Professional LPK25. That's how I'm jamming these notes in, by the way, in case you wondered how that's happening. Um, what else have we got? Drones. Uh, I have to say, this is my favourite drone in the whole of Hybrid 3. Have a listen to this. That's fat. You just want to say, the audience is listening. Fantastic stuff. So good stuff for like top of the hours if you're creating jingles and bits like that. Let's have a listen to another drone. It's kind of like the city light, that one, isn't it? And then we've got Moog bass tone. And we've got uh, noise swell bass. Wow. Membrane killer sub. <laughs> nice. Okay, so you can you can get the idea of how Hybrid 3 works. Hybrid 3, by the way, is one of the biggest kind of virtual instruments from Air Music Tech, and they have a load of plug-in and add-on packs that you might want to check out as well if you're going to be using this regularly for your audio production. But let's move on now, add a new track in, and we'll go back into instruments, audio unit instruments, and we're going to look at Loom and see how this baby works. There's Loom and there's also Loom 2 available to purchase separately uh, that can do all kinds of cool stuff, and it can create a lovely visual display like this. Beautiful. And uh, obviously we can change the kind of instrument we're using, so look at the different stuff we've got here. So you've got all of that, and uh, let's go to bells. Hitting the bells, good for Christmas time, I guess. Some pads here. Which is really nice. And then we get into the sound effects where we can have fun with an alien landscape. Whoa. And you can manipulate, obviously, the way that goes using this morph pad here. You've got other things that you can move along, like... This might work better on a few of the other effects, though. Let's look at this one. Critters, very nice. Uh, into the Sprout. Nice, very cool indeed. Uh, what else have we got here? Let's have a look. Oh my gosh. 
Sounds like a cat. And you can see I'm changing the speed there. Lots and lots of different settings you can change here on the Loom 2 kind of synthesizer. So again, another really good option if you want to create some cool sound design. But moving through so I can fit as many of these uh, instruments into this tutorial as possible. I'm going to come back to the riser. I'm going to save that one for last because I kind of jammed with this earlier, really liked it. So let's look in and expand to expand with an exclamation mark to and we'll get this loaded into logic and have a play with this interface now expand to what is cool about it i guess it's called expand for a reason because you can expand so we've got the bright pads as a massive pad at the moment let's pick something nice like um this one fat boy okay uh we'll go for something different pad layers maybe Let's find something that's nice and easy, maybe acoustic piano. Okay. Okay, so we've got a piano there, but what you can do with expand is you can layer stuff. So say we wanted to bring strings in as well. We can bring in like, uh, let's bring in a string with the piano. See, that's nice, right? We're layering strings and piano. And then obviously we can add effects. So uh, say I turn the level down on the strings. So we just hear the piano again. I can obviously pan the piano left and right, but we've got some cool effects here like uh, room reverb. And if I enable that room reverb and turn that effect up, you can hear it kicking in, maybe get a bigger one like uh, a bright hole. So you can hear that really kicking in. And we can have a chorus on effect too, turn that up. Let's pick something that uh, maybe turn the rate up and the depth. And we'll go for something different. Chaos delay. Listen to what it does to the piano there. That's pretty cool, isn't it? Uh, tape echo. Uh, what else have we got here? Phaser. Until you get exactly what you're looking for, then bring this back in. Maybe pan a little bit. And then finally, we might go in here and we might say, well, we can add some vocals. This is pretty cool. Now you can hear the vocals coming in. And finally, we might want to finish it off with a bit of a drum. Or even better, uh, something good that you've got here. Let's see if I can find what I was using just earlier. Our loops here. So we can bring in a loop and we can actually jam now. But if you hold down the keys as you're playing on your, your MIDI interface keyboard, you can actually keep that loop going. So so again, just something you can do with Expand too. But now my final and favorite uh, Air Music Tech plugin that I've tested so far at least, uh, it has to be the riser. Now, many of you have mentioned before on my channel about creating risers, where can you get good risers from, riser sound effects are something we need not only just in our own um, productions, but also they're used often in music production, in dance music, and they sound a bit like that. I mean, that's really cool, right? And you can change everything here. So you've got different generators. You can mess about with these uh, and really get the riser sounding exactly how you want. Create your own custom riser. But just for, for speed, I'm going to go through a few of the different risers that you can get here. So this is another one that you can get. That one's rather dark. We could have something like this. And some of them go down and some of them go up. If you click the swap here, it'll swap it around. So then... If it, was right, if it was going down, then now it's going up kind of thing, which is pretty cool. We got this one. That one's going down, but we can soon swap it around. Horror noise sweep. Psychedelic fall. Oh my goodness. So that one's falling down, but we can quite easily rise it back up. I'm telling you, Air Music Technology, hours of endless fun, literally installing and playing with these plugins. Let me know how you get on with them in the comments below if you have a play. And if you want to win the complete set, the AI EP3 complete set worth $999, it's part of our main prize in the awesome audio gear giveaway. Just go to mrc.fm slash giveaway. That is mrc.fm slash giveaway and good luck. <laughs>